what's up people how's your mama doing and, uh, I thought man tonight I thought I was gonna do a video cause I was I was just gonna think about thinking about other things on the next video I'm gonna do but I didn't think I was gonna do it tonight till I was watching one of my uh, watching Aesop's video one of his videos about Willow Smith and and he showed the picture and I seen it I th and I thought in my mind what the fuck is wrong with her parents as y'all see that you see Willow Smith posing with the tongue ring and I was sitting up here thinking I said what was Jada picking and Will Smith thinking letting their 12 year old or 11 year old daughter get a tongue ring now I don't know what the fuck they was thinking because usually when women get their tongue pierced they usually get it for style or for something else or sex but why would any parent in this motherfucking world let their child get a tongue ring you can sit there and say oh it's 2012 Afro Joe I don't give a fuck when you let a 12 year old get a tongue ring you let a 12 year old or 11 year old get a tongue ring what's next you letting them have sex see this is why kids do what they do because the parents don't want to put their foot down or punish them because oh we love our kids we let them do what they want so you don't mind that your daughter is trying to be the next Rihanna because the motherfucking people the damn record label wanted her to be the next Rihanna I don't get it why you letting your child get a tongue ring I don't know why you letting your child trying to be the next Rihanna like Will Smith and Jana Pickett need to realize something you keep on letting your child step out like she is now with the tongue ring and shit somebody gonna jack her little ass up and rape the shit out of her because your dumb two dumb asses can't raise a fucking child right like Will Smith, I don't give a fuck if you was the Fresh Prince. You ain't shit no more since you dropped that, dropped the name. Ever since you got that show, you think you badass Billy Gun. Ever since you did Bad Boys, Bad Boys Two, Men in Black, Men in Black, Men in Black Two, Men in Black Three, Ali, Seven Pounds. You thought you was badass Billy Gun. Jane the Pig, she thought she was badass because she got on a, she was on a different world. You know, the spinoff show of the Cosby show. Then she went on to, a, what was it, Set It Off, Tales from the Crypt movie. Oh, uh, what else? Uh, uh, uh. The, the, the Matrix. Uh, Madagascar 1, 2, and 3 and 4 I think there was like 4 and no, all was it 2 or was it 3 or something like that but I, I just don't get it man that you gonna let your 12 year old daughter get a fucking tongue ring I, I'm for real man are, are, are they really that fucking stupid where they're letting their child go out with the tongue ring I understand letting her find her own style of find, 
find, find out who she is. But when you come to a part where you letting your child get a piercing, her tongue pierce, or something where it's going to be sexual, then you're, then, at a, for real, that, that's bad business, man. I ain't never in my life seen a damn child that's under the age, that's 11 years old or 12 years old with the fucking tongue ring. When I was 12 or 12 and 11, I didn't have, I ain't seen no girls with tongue rings. You know why? Because the parents want to whip the shit out of them. What kind of parents is Jaden, Jada and Will Smith to lie their damn child that's under, that's under the age of 13, no, under the age of 18, get a tongue? I can understand 17 or 18 years old, you can, you're allowing her to get a tongue ring. But 12 or 11, what kind of fucking parents are you? I ain't never thought in my motherfucking life that I see the day where two dumbass parents gonna let their damn 12, 11 year old or 12 year old daughter get a fucking tongue ring. I'm, I wonder, do they really want to be grandparents? I wonder, do they want their 12, 11 year old daughter to get pregnant at a young age? Because to me, it seems like they they want this. It seems like they want their child to throw her shit away. Just because she had that one hit song, I put my hand back in front, I put my hand back in front, doesn't mean shit. That's because she got famous parents, doesn't mean shit. See, this is what happens when you put your kids in the limelight. When you put your kids in the limelight, they go crazy. They go crazy because these kids don't know how to be responsible when they get in that limelight. That spotlight. Get all up in that spotlight. Now you look at Jamie Foxx. He, he's, in the, he's in the spotlight. He does a movie. He was on The Living Color. But you don't see his kids acting the damn fool and shit. But you look at Billy Ray's daughter, Miley. Look what happened to her when she stepped in that line, that spotlight. What happened? Lindsay Lohan, Ty Bridges, Danny Bonaduce, Gary Coleman, Dana Plato. That's all I'm saying, man. You want to protect your kids from shit like that where they don't go overboard and get addicted to drugs or do something stupid enough to where they catch something that they can't get rid of or they get hooked up on something where they got to go to rehab. It seems like their parents don't give a damn, man, because why would any parents let their 11 or 12 year old daughter get they the tongue pierce. I understand the ears. Maybe a nose ring, okay? I could be fine with it. I can be fine with it because, hey, that's just a little simple shit. She's expressing herself. But a tongue ring, that's too damn far, man. Too damn far, man. I, I'm telling you, man, I, that girl's going to end up having a baby before she even hits 18 because her fucking parents don't give two shits of a fuck. And, oh, I just don't get it, man. I, I think I, Will Smith need to get his punk ass fucked up on the spot. And Jada needs to get hot monkey ass kicked. If Jada Pickin would stay off the fucking road and stop touring with that little jacked up, fucked up band, maybe she can be a better parent. Or maybe Will Smith stop kissing ass up to the corporate offices of the of of, of the studios 
just to get a, another movie put out, and he'll probably be a fucking better parent. You never see, you never seen Will Smith, like it's funny, her brother Jaden, her brother Jaden, you don't hear shit out of him. Oh, what about the oldest boy, uh, Will Smith's oldest boy? You don't like this is why I, this is why it makes me proud that his oldest son is not in the in the movie business because he ain't stupid enough to get off into it. I'll tell you, man, it's just straight up fucked up. The how. They allow this girl to get a time. I'm for real, man. This girl going to get pregnant at a young age. Because the fucking parents don't know how to be parents. I'm for real. What parents will allow their child to get? If I ever would have caught my, my nieces with tongue rings. Oh, hell, hell no. Nah. I'll be whipping ass and taking names. Because I wouldn't be having it. I'm tell you, man, it's getting worse. It is getting fucked up. I don't like I said before. I don't give a fuck if it's 2012. No child that is 11 or 12 years old should have a damn tongue ring. See, this is why people wonder why kids are get, having babies. Babies having babies. Oh, that's why they show 16 and pregnancies on the air because. Kids getting pregnant and want to get on there. Now it's getting worse where thir uh, what was it? 13 year olds, 12 year olds. See, it's going to get to a point where it's going to go keep going down from 13 to 12 to 12 to 11, from 11 to 10, from 10 to 9, 9 to 8, 8 to 7. Say, Afro Joe, you talking crazy. No, I'm not talking crazy. It's just a fucking fact. When parents don't give two shits of a fuck about their kids. And you wonder why kids are gangbanging and shit. Because they don't, these fucking parents don't know how to whip that ass. Oh, there's laws protecting them. Them motherfucking laws need to be changed. I can understand abuse, but sometimes you got to beat that ass just to make them kids straighten the fuck up. And hell no, I did not Photoshop these pictures either. And I'm talking, I'm telling you, man. I see. I think they pick. I think Jada Pickett Smith and Willow Smith. I mean, Jada Pickett Smith and Will Smith is pimping out their child. I think they. I think they sit on the street corner every night. Willow go out there and suck some dick. I guess. That's what. I guess what. That's what they're doing. Making her sit on the street corner and suck dick. Because there is no way in hell a parent's going to allow a damn 12 year old to uh, have a tongue ring. This is too damn far, man. This is taking it a little bit too far. you trying to t see. Since she's doing these songs and little movies, whatever she's doing, she's becoming an icon. She's becoming an icon. That means kids want to be like her. That means kids want to shave their heads and shit. Kids want to sit there and get a tongue ring under the age of 12. Like I said, man, you can blame artists a little bit, but you can't blame every... You can't put the full blame on the artist, but you can blame an artist a little bit. But it's not an artist's job to, uh, 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 to raise your kid but when it's a kid when it's a kid that becomes an icon you gotta watch out what they do because whatever they do can affect your kid too because one thing is you know how back in the back in the day you used to use this saying well you let Tim well Timmy gets to do Timmy's parents let him do it and what your parents always say, well, you ain't then, you ain't Timmy. Now your kids, now these kids today is gonna be start using that term. Twelve years old, Willow Smith's got a tongue green, but your ass ain't Willow. 
And that's how it is, man. These damn kids are going to be, oh, can I get a tongue ring, mama? Can I get a tongue ring? Willow Smith's got a tongue ring. Willow Smith's got a tongue ring. Uh, and it's pissing me off because the parents allow this shit to go on. And the, and the parents, uh, the parents are letting Will Smith and Jada Pickett need to get their ass stomped. Because one thing is, man, they don't, they, they're not teaching this girl morals. They, they're not teaching this girl from right from wrong. If this, if they was teaching these kids right from wrong, this girl, little girl, wouldn't have no tongue ring. It's bad enough that the kids are getting gang. They're in a the, in a gang. They're sitting up killing other kids, selling drugs, making babies, fucking teachers, getting fucked by the preachers, and they making it worse. Will Jada, Will Jada, 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 and Will Smith is not helping none by letting each child get a tongue ring. You just showing the world that you allowing your kids to do well the fuck they want and, and get away with it. I'm t that's how it is. Oh, I just don't get these fuckers today. They piss me off. They get away with so much, and they wonder why these kids turn out so fucked up. It's because parents don't want to do their fucking jobs. They too wrapped up into their little bullshit world. They only care about that mighty dollar. They don't care about that kid. They don't care about their kids. They care about that mighty dollar. And their kids end up fucked up. When that money's gone, that's when they turn their back on the kid. You you ask Danny Bonaducci, when that money dried up from the Partridge family, what happened? His mama turned the back on him. His parents turned the back on him. I'm telling you, man, I wonder what's going to happen when her money dries up. And she can't get a deal with no, not with Paramount, not with MGM, not with Sony, not with Rockefeller, Rocker, Rocker, Rockefeller, or none of them motherfuckers. See, you, they don't care. Parent, these parents don't care. Give a damn. They only care about that mighty fucking dollar, man, and let they... If Willow Smith was my child, and she asked me, Daddy, can I get a turn? First thing I say was, fuck no. Not till you're 35. If you, if you, if you sneak behind my back, I'm gonna bust your ass. Because that's how you parent. You don't, you don't get your damn 12 or 11 year old daughter a tongue pierced. You just setting that ass up. And you wonder why pedophiles are growing by the, no, by the minute. It's because how these fucking parents dress their kids. And these damn TV shows ain't helping tiaras and tia, dollars and tiaras and dance moms. These shows, that, that's like porn to the fucking pedophile. Nick, how would you know? Uh, how would I know? That's fucked up. You're gonna ask me how would I know. It's like this. A fucking pedophile would look at that shit. That's why they got high rain and see. Like, look at, uh, what, what was it? Uh, John, John Bonet Ramsey's daddy. What, what did he say? That's porn to pedophiles. He said that on The View. Look it up. But that's how it is. Why would you let your 12 to 11 year old or 12 year old daughter get a tongue pierced? That's just plain out stupid. Like I said, Willow, uh, Will Smith and Jaden Pickensmith need to get their ass 
fucked up on the spot because they rather have their kids, her daughter, their daughter right. This is bullshit, man. Why would any parent do this shit? Why would any fucking parent allow this shit to to go on? It pisses me off. I'm not a parent, but I'm an uncle. But it pisses me off to see this shit because the parents are not doing their fucking jobs because they too. Oh, she's she expressing herself. No, she's not. You pimping her ass out. You're whoring your child out. You horn out your child. And that's how it is, yo. You pimping your child out. Well, this has been Afro Joe the Wookie. Follow me on Twitter at Afro Joe the Wookie. Subscribe to my channel, CeeLo Jr. 2, CeeLo Jr. 3. If you don't like what I got to say, you can kiss my ass and move the fuck on. If you like what I got to say, leave a comment or a video response. Tell me what you think about this situation. Like I said, Will Smith and Jada Pickett Smith are pimping out their daughter because they allow their daughter to get a tongue ring. So that's kind of fucked up and that's fucked up. I wouldn't do shit like that.